there, there was a congressman just last week who stated that God's will has, is of no concern to us. This is a United States congressman, and he was heavily criticized. Like, if you're a Christian, you don't want to hear that. But we still are called to pray for our leaders. But, you know, that's biblical. Because that person, it's just that person is ignorant. He just doesn't know. Because, listen, the Bible says, all authority is from God. That's right. All promotion Even and power bad comes government from is better than no government, you know. I agree. Even bad government is better than no government. So, I instead of part of it's because Paul says when you pray for the government he said it makes your life easier when you we live we live in a, in a in a country where we can say you know say almost anything yeah. we want you know because there, there's that freedom there are many people who live in governments that yeah that that has no free I mean if you do that in certain places you know you find people show up at your door and uh, they grab you and nobody ever sees you again sort of thing mm -hmm. so you know instead of, instead of criticizing just pray we we find paul the apostle paul who lived in the time of nero yeah nero was he was nuts to say the least You're wicked and yet we don't find paul criticizing that I think we could be uh, critical of laws, though. Like, for, for example, the, the the law of abortion. We know um, mo most people understand that the, that life begins at conception. So we could be critical of, of those permissive laws. Uh, we, we don't want to see the unborn being killed. There, there was a um, there was a movie, 2019 movie uh, called uh, Unplanned. Uh, Abby Johnson was formerly a director of Planned Parenthood, and she walked into uh, one of the surgical rooms and she witnessed an abortion and she did a 180 now she's an anti-abortion uh, activist so there's an example where um, instead of being critical of the government and creating her job and being critical of the government she's now an activist and a spokesman for for, for pro-life so there's an example how we can turn things 180 and instead of just criticizing the government all the time going out and, and doing something about it maybe maybe helping to, to, to enlighten or to give some more information or, or, or helping uh, mothers uh, find adoption uh, options or whatever it is. I mean, there, there, there's always, um, God always can, can, can give us guidance and answers and wisdom through the Bible and when, when we pray. And, and we should all aim to make this place just a little bit better. We leave the earth just a little bit better than we found it.